as we return to live action here at the Hurley Pro Sunset Beach presented by Shiseido. Nat Young, new heat in the water versus Seth Moniz and Nat's gonna have to take another lap around as that wave was a no-go. Now it's gone to the point where you're looking for the sets and trying to find those bigger ones to get the big scores. Yeah, energy starting to subside. The, the, the swell as a whole changing directions, turning maybe a little bit more of the north element, and uh, that's going to change the, the personality here at sunset. Yes, yeah, Zeke, nervous moments. You got that 7.9 quite early in the heat, and you just had to try to get that back up the whole heat. You know, talk about that. Every heat is a great opportunity, but uh, it's, a, it's a long year. It's a big picture. We're dropping into this one. Seth Moniz mm. slashing off the top there and handles a lot of the bounce before kicking out into the channel. How was that bounce? Ooh, <laughs> it was like being on a trampoline. Here we got a surfer taking off. Looks like Baron Mamiya back there. Or no, Seth, sorry. That is a big snap in the bowl. I mean, it's just, you know, it's going to keep pumping, but it's a different oh. day out here. Oh, my. Uh, Strider, Seth just went down off of a huge floater at the end section there. Well, I think the thing that you don't get from in there is the playing field, how big everything is, how much water is moving, and how much space you have to cover, and, and where you have to get to, and when the sets are coming where you have to be, and when they're out, when you're out, you know, when they're not coming, where you have to move back in, when you're paddling hundreds of yards at a time just to position yourself. Here we go, Seth Moniz, long bottom turn, carves it through this section, stalls the bottom turn again, a long LR takes it all the way back around, and that's going to be it for this wave. Seth Moniz looking to better his low of a 3.3. Great score there, and with the absence of some of the bigger names and some of the favorites out here at Sunset, Felipe Toledo is starting to put himself right at the top of my mind. Caught a little bit on his heels here. Nat Young has to travel a long way before even having a chance to do a turn. So that's going to be a no-go for Nat Young. And he's just going to have to take another lap out the back. We'll see what the judges think as we go back to Nat Young. Chasing Seth Moniz right now. Needs a 5.5 and a lot of unsteady water and... Nat just not able to bury his rail on that wave and really uh, get in a, a solid bottom turn. Here we go, Seth Moniz Whoa. has to yank the rail through that first turn, hooks it on the second turn, patient off the bottom now, another big wow. snap for oh. Moniz and a missed opportunity, not getting the finish on that wave. Moniz was on his way to a good score and bettering his low of a 3.3. That bump that he hit and he just wobbled the rail and he just settled down into that bottom turn, held the rail, came into this inside, unleashed on that section. Nat Young looking, he needs something and he needs it now. Super important wave for Nat Young, waiting patiently at the bottom to start his attack here. Nice lip glide and really kind of had to nurse that one up there for the completion. Looking for a 6.34, I want your, your first. <laughs> All right, Seth Moniz into the quarterfinals. We got more action here from Sunset Beach. Hurley Pro Sunset Beach presented by Shiseido Moro.